it looks like Macy's grown boyfriend has been arrested. And so Macy took to her Twitter to respond to the back that she received regarding her boyfriend's situation. And she says, you're loud and wrong. Leave me the F alone. Then she added, I just need to hear my man voice right now. Everything is everything though. I gotta learn how to shut the F up and let people think what the F they want. But you all be having me f up though. And so with Macy's boyfriend being locked up, do you believe Macy will wait for him or she will move on? Let me know your thoughts on this down down in the comment section below. Now, I don't want to speak on this next topic because it looks like Misty did go live to make it clear that she doesn't miss Kay because she acts weird. She also gave her side on how she feels about the situation that happened between Ben and TJ. And this is what she said. Do you miss Key? No, I do not miss Key. Key is weird to me. She just, oh, I do not miss that girl. Like, she's weird. I can't. I can't mean, I'm... <laughs> I missed the old her before she started acting weird, but that's not even her no more, so I can't even miss it. There's no room for it to miss because she's weird. And, you know, like... How she weird? It's just the way she moved, the stuff she do. She just weird off. Like, and it don't stop. It keeps going. It's still going. So I just keep my distance. Because I'm a... Yeah. How do you feel about TJ and Nene's situation that's going on? Do you feel mad? No, I don't feel mad because when I was getting, about, getting beat up by my baby daddy, who gave a fuck? Nobody. But at the end of the day, I feel like they're both wrong in the situation. Both parties played a part very, very well. So I don't think y'all should be coming at one person. I feel like y'all should be coming at none of them. But y'all going to come at something because that's what y'all do. But if I was to say who y'all going to come at, i say both of them. They both was in the wrong and they both played a part. But that's not none of my business. But, you know, I'm just saying, like, just leave both parties alone. Like, they both play the part. Don't make the situation like this or like this, bigger like this, because they both play the part, okay? That's how I feel. And I wasn't even there. I, that's just something that I heard. But she's so beautiful. Thank you. Girl, be quiet. I got asked a question, so I'm going to talk. And if you don't want to hear me talk, babes, get off the live. Like, keep asking that question. So, what you want me to do? I'm sorry I'm about to start clocking y'all every time because y'all be having me messed up on these lives, on this social media. Y'all not about to keep playing with me because I'm nice. Everybody know I'm nice. Everybody know I'm the nicest person ever in the world. But y'all keep trying me. I'm done. Y'all, I'm done. Now, I do want to move on to this last topic because it looks like Magic dropped a new YouTube video with TJ asking him some rude questions about his life. And one of the questions was about if TJ cares about the hate he's been getting. And this is what he said. It's actually not, getting to him. Not really. It's actually getting to him. You know what I'm saying? And I just feel like you guys should lighten up. You know, because it's hurting his feelings. Right. And it's messing with his mental. Right. You no, know, all the hate online can really do something to a person. Right. It's but it's not it's not gonna do nothing to me though. It said do you care though? This this is uh do I care? Um Do you feel like in a way you do care about your supporters' opinions? Yeah, in a way? like I do care about certain like Opinions on you and stuff like that, or like they view on you, like you do take that in consideration. Yeah. 